fire signs what's up you all it's mommy water and i am back i hope you all are doing good at this time it is your turn you all are up let's see what the holy spirit wants you all to know let's see what the collective messages are for my leos my aries and my sagittarius and happy birthday to any sagittarius listeners out there okay Let's see what's going on with y'all. Holy Spirit, I come to you on behalf of my fire sign collective. Holy Spirit, what is the collective message for my Aries, my Leos, and my Sagittarius at this time? Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Messages from the universe. Ooh. Ooh. Well... What are the messages, Holy Spirit? What what insight and guidance do you have for my fire sign collective? Something going on. Let's do one more shuffle. What is the message, Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. Let's go. Let's go. We have the chariot. We have the emperor, Aries energy on the bottom. And we have the tower with the five of swords. And the seven of wands, okay? So we're going to stop. We don't pause, fire signs. I feel like somebody is about to come at you about something. You're going to have to defend yourself about something here, fire signs. Someone is about to charge at you all. You are sitting in a very stable solid energy right now with this emperor card here you ain't making no noise you don't really got no hiccups happening in your life but somebody is about to try to cause a hiccup for you all with this tower energy because they mad and they want to fight okay it could be a cancer sign with this chariot here but whoever it is they're about to come at you hard they want to fight with this five of swords to the seven of wands Oh, they most definitely want to fight. They want to pick a fight. They want to start a fight. I just heard start a riot. Okay, so I don't know who this is that's about to attack you all. Whoever I'm picking up on in my fire sign collective. We have the star and we have the two of cups. It could be about a relationship. Maybe this person has been enlightened that you are somebody's choice when it comes to a relationship and they've lost as a result of that we have the hermit here okay and i feel like that's the case i feel like whoever this is it's about to come at you they've learned that you're the ideal choice for somebody when it comes to a relationship somebody feels like you will bring their life into an alignment and they're hoping that they can connect with you and whoever this chariot energy is, they know that you're about to be the person who balances whoever this is. This, um, okay, so let me pause. You are this divine being here. You are also this temperance energy. You are some kind of earth angel. Whoever this is, that wants to be in a relationship with you, fire signs, they feel like you will bring some type of truth and clarity to their life. They consider you the light at the end of the tunnel, okay? Whoever they're running from, because if they're running towards you, they're running away from something, okay? Whoever they are running from, that is this, tower five of swords seven of wands energy okay they've had their block up to this person this person wants to fight and argue and i feel like whoever this is that's coming towards y'all they ain't fighting and arguing with this person anymore so they're gonna try to pick a fight with you and i feel like i picked up on something like this in a reading that i did and I'm, i don't know which reading that was here y'all go with this this strength energy but see Y'all not finna back down without a fight. If anybody comes towards you with that bullshit, you are not going to just allow them to challenge you. 
okay, without a fight. Like, it's just not, I'm really getting that from whoever I'm picking up on. Because you don't even know that this person is planning to come towards you with this offer. I cannot remember what. Yeah. I did a reading where a feminine was mad because she knew that her ex was going towards an empress. And she was going to tell this empress some details about the ex so that she wouldn't want to be with him. She was going to try to tell him, tell her that he had a disease or something. But whoever this is that's coming towards y'all, they want to fight. I'm picking up on fight energy. Clarify that Holy Spirit with this, with this five of swords to the seven of wands. We have the king of wands. I feel like y'all going, y'all going to have to be in this king of wands energy. Y'all, y'all not going to back down. And you're going to have to defend yourself. Because somebody want to fight y'all. And I'm really just picking that up heavy. Especially for the King of Wands to come out here. You're going to have to be in warrior mode. Because they feel like you took their man. It's really giving that. Who is this chariot energy, Holy Spirit? Can we get some insight? Hierophant. They, they feel like they've learned. They know a lot about you. They've learned how this person feels for you. We have the hangman. You are the choice. And this choice has got their shit fucked up. You're the ideal choice with this lover's energy here. Okay. This is real interesting. Y'all are this king of wands emperor energy though. Y'all are also this temperance and strength energy. It's like you are going, this person that's coming at you is really going to try to fight you. Like I'm really picking up on this shit and you're going to have to defend yourself. But I feel like this situation is still going to be balanced in your favor. Whoever this is that think they're going to come at you, they about to get caught up somehow. Okay. Clarify that we have that child. I can't make it up fire signs. What did I just say? They're about to get caught up somehow. They may even get arrested. Something may happen to this person on their way to come and attack you and try to have a fight with you. They may end up getting arrested. I don't know why I'm hearing arrested. We have the Knight of Wands. This bold and erratic action that they're hoping to take towards you. I don't even feel like they're going to make it to you. We have the Two of Wands. Just got a notification. I don't think they're going to even make it to you. I feel like on their way to come fuck with you, they're going to learn something is going to happen. They're going to find out something that's going to stop them or they're going to get in trouble for something else. We have death. I'm telling you, whatever this, whoever this cherry energy that's trying to come towards my fire signs, Whatever they got planned, how, whatever it is, it's going to be stopped, okay? So I wouldn't even really worry about this person. Because again, I don't feel like you all have been enlightened and that you even know that someone wants to be with you. They know it, but you don't know it. I'm sorry about that, fire signs. I had to answer a phone call. And when I tell you that was just an, an unnecessary irritation <laughs> that I just went through, okay? It really just got on my fucking nerves real bad, real fast. And that's what this chariot energy is wanting to do towards y'all, okay? This person really wants to aggravate the hell out of y'all and really piss you off and make you act out of character. We child look what had been sitting here i ain't even touched the card that had fell out before i answered that phone call card been sitting here and i just turned it over and look what it is this whole want to fight whoever this cherry energy is whether it's a masculine or feminine you are sitting in this boss energy you are having a victory obviously for whoever this third party is to see you as a star two of cups okay and whoever this chariot energy is, they want to fight. They in the five of swords, the seven of wands, and the five of wands now about you. 
And I'm telling you, y'all don't even know that this person, come, it wants to come towards you. Not the person that wants to fight, nor the person that they mad about. We have the three of wands. You, do, you are not aware that either one of these energies want to approach you, whether it's for something negative or positive, okay? What else, Holy Spirit? This person is definitely trying to interrupt your life. They think that you know that they are separated from this third party. Both of these people think that you know that they are broken up, okay? This cherry energy thinks that you know that their ex wants to be with you, but you don't. Okay, it's a lot of miscommunication happening. And y'all, I'm trying to tell you, boy, I'm talking about the Holy Spirit is just hitting it. I can't even hardly get out my mouth quick enough with this page of wands. The communication is not hitting on nothing in this situation because I feel like you're out of the loop. And these people are trying to bring you into something that you really don't even know nothing about. Even this ex that wants to come towards you, okay? This chariot energy's ex. Can I get some information on this person who sees my fire sign as the star two of cups, Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. We have the seven of cups. This is why I'm just like, okay, I'm going to tell y'all what I'm hearing, fire signs. Don't even waste your time with whoever this person is that's coming back into your life. They are they coming out here as the seven of cups. They are full of illusions. They got some crazy third party that's on y'all tail that want to fight y'all. And y'all not even in no relationship with this person yet. And they already got somebody wanting to fight y'all about they false ass. Period. On the bottom, the card is the Four of Cups. Do not accept this person's love offer. It's a shady ass love offer. Okay? And I really feel like this Seven of Cups told this Cherry Energy about you to try to make this Cherry Energy jealous. To make them feel like you were some type of competition. That's why you you came out as this boss from the beginning. Because... The Seven of Cups really pumped you up to this chariot here, okay? They really made this chariot energy feel like they were about to embark on this star-studded, luxurious life when they get in this relationship with you. And you ain't even talking to this person. I'm telling you, you four swords, whatever you had with this this. Seven of Cups, that shit been laid to rest. Okay? They trying to have you in the Nine of Swords and you ain't even fooling with them. Their lies, they, they have exaggerated the truth about y'all and what could happen between y'all to make their ex mad. Now their ex want to fight you and you ain't even fucking with this person. That's crazy. That's why they came out here as the seven of cups. Because I was trying to figure out, we got the three of swords. And to make matters even worse, this person, it looks like they broke your heart when you was messing with them in the past. They had you in some type of third party relationship. Now they're trying to bring up your name to make somebody else jealous. But what it's really giving is that you probably are sitting in this boss energy. You probably are sitting in the star energy. You probably do look good from a distance. Okay? And it's probably even better up close. That's why this chariot feels so threatened. That's why they want to come at you so hard. They want to try to bring you down a notch or two. Because obviously you are more elevated than them. But they coming at you about a motherfucker you don't even deal with. That you don't got no connection to. You may have had some love for them in the past. But you are not invested in this person. You don't even communicate with this person. I'm hearing with that page one spawn not like that before. It definitely is a lack of communication. We have the son. You started your life. 
in another direction. You've experienced a rebirth elsewhere, okay? You have no idea what these folks got going on, and that's sad that this liar then put you in some bullshit to try to make his ex mad, and now this ex want to fight you. But I'm telling you, when this person comes towards you, they ain't going to even, they ain't going to make it to you. You know, we got that back here with this Eight of Swords. I was picking that up with this Hierophant and the Hangman, and then we got confirmation about it with this Eight of Swords, Knight of Wands, and this Death energy here. Okay, so I would not be worried about anybody actually coming up to you and trying to fight you. Okay, that's what they want to do. That don't mean that they're going to be able to do it. Okay, they can want to do that shit all day long, but that don't mean that it's actually going to occur. And I, it's really some type of like the universe is going to step in if this person actually tries to come at you in any way. And they're going to be stopped in another way. Some other bullshit they got going on is going to get them caught up. Or something else is going to occur, like a freak occurrence that's going to stop them in their tracks. Okay? That's what I'm getting on that situation. So I wouldn't even be pressed about it, fire signs. What's going to be the outcome for this liar? The seven of cups that dragged my fire signs into some bullshit. We have the magician. Some kind of action is going to get taken against this person for lying on an empress. Okay? I feel like this person is going to try to come at you. They said all of that to whoever this ex-chariot energy is. Because they probably are going to come, try to take action towards you. Because you are this divine being. You coming out as the emperor and the empress now. They they use your name to try to make this cherry energy jealous. Because I'm telling y'all, fire signs, y'all are doing good right now. Y'all really are. Y'all really have, excuse me, bossed up. And so the Seven of Cups presented this illusion to make this other person feel bad, to make them feel like they were inferior to you all. But that, that's just crazy to me because you don't even fuck. I'm talking about you don't even fuck with the Seven of Cups because how they broke your heart and played you. And they out here using your name for leverage, okay? Trying to cause you anxiety and worry in the future. And that's exactly where you're going to be if you deal with this person. You're going to be in the Nine of Swords. But I feel like y'all already know that. Okay? Y'all ain't get to this Emperor Empress energy without learning a few lessons. Okay? And you have learned about people like the Seven of Cups here. Then whoever this person is, they are an extreme liar and manipulator. Okay? They sell dreams all day long. And you've learned a lot of lessons from this energy. So I just don't even see y'all entertaining anybody like this. Like they're not even coming out as a knight or a page, honey. This motherfucker coming out as a seven of cups and this cherry energy ready to fight you about a damn child, boo. Any final messages for my fire signs? You need to make sure you reject his ass too. Whoever the hell this is from your past. Anything else? We have the Ten of Cups. So that you can continue to remain in the direction that you're going. So that you can continue to have this Ten of Cups future for yourself. And I do really feel like y'all going to do that. I think the Holy Spirit just wanted y'all to be aware of what was happening. But this is the type of shit that the Most High protects us from that we don't even be knowing about. Like when people say God be protecting you from things, you have no idea of some of the things that God has kept away from you. And this is an example of that, fire signs, because I really don't feel like y'all know that these people, you probably don't even know these people was together, let alone broke up. Okay, I'm getting that. You don't know nothing about these people's business and you don't care. And this Seven of Cups has brought you into that bullshit 
on a whole lie that this cherry energy probably do believe to a certain extent because at one point you were in a third party situation shit with this seven of cups but you're not anymore that that horn was spiritual confirmation so in her mind it's a possibility for this to be the case but you truly have no contact or connection with this seven of cups and this is why the universe is going to block this chariot energy from coming at you okay so i'm gonna leave it here I hope this message helps you all. I hope it gives you insight and clarification, fire signs. But always remember, if it doesn't apply, please let it fly. Take only what resonates. Leave the rest. Ooh, y'all just got a download. I heard Leo. You are Leo. You got Leo in your chart specifically, whoever I'm talking to. That's dealing with this situation. Okay? Clarify that, Holy Spirit. You're a Leo. We have the fool. You really you left that situation behind, though. You said that you were not going to deal with anybody like that and that you were going to take action to elevate your life in another direction. You left that shit behind. But I did just hear Leo, so... You know, if you got Leo in your sun, moon, and rising, this may be even more specific for you. This might hit home a little bit more, okay? But I'm going to leave it here. I hope this message helps you all. I hope it gives you insight and guidance moving forward. But always remember, if it doesn't apply, please let it fly. Take only what resonates, leave the rest, and I'll be back soon with another one. Peace, fire signs.